So uh, today I'm having a look at um, the Storm 91P, um, which looks like it's got some uh, a good chance of forming into the first cyclone for the season. Um, that would make it very early. Uh, normally we don't see these things till at least November, and if we do see one start now, then that's going to mean it's a long uh, season, which means uh, lots of uh, cyclones and probably quite a few intense ones as well. Um, and a better chance of seeing one or two across the coast of uh, Queensland, which is the average. So let's have a look at what we've got here. We can see it's uh, spinning uh, nicely. There's lots of uh, uh, convection being cloud being fed into the system. Here's the sort of the center of the low. Um, currently, probably a bit of uh, uh, shear at the top because you know you can see the clouds sort of pushing over the top of it here. Uh, but when I checked this morning at each of the levels, uh, we had. Now this is not this is not current. This is actual just forecast information, but it's based on uh, observations and. When we load up each of the levels, we can see that there's clear rotation. Uh, a little bit messy when we get to the, the upper upper levels, as I was just talking about. So uh, let's have a look at the satellites. Uh, there we go. Here's Queensland over here. This is PNG here. Solomon Islands here. So we're sitting in the Solomon uh, Sea at the moment. Uh, looking at the forecast, this is the system here. Uh, quite substantial uh, storms around it. And as we move through to Wednesday, um, possibly Tuesday, we can see that it should have the potential to reach uh, cyclone uh, categorization. Uh, only looking at the um, at the uh, pressure there, but um, there's a lot more that gets counted into the um, equation, mainly wind speed. Uh, so it's a bit hard to tell uh, by just looking at it. But as we progress further through, we see it tracks east, and then it should track back west, and then weaken by uh, the weekend and then move across and the tightly packed uh, isobars should mean some uh, wind which is pretty much the same as what we're getting right now uh, plus um, some showers from those southeasterlies based on that high so um, it's a good time to prepare your uh, property um, put all those things away if you've got building projects Make sure that they're stacked away inside sheds. Uh, don't leave them out. Don't just think that they're someone else's problem because they will come back to bite you. Um, so that's really all there is to say apart from the next cyclone name uh, should be Cyclone um, Owen. Wow. Wow. Sorry, I had to do that twice. Just had to. It's a quick shameless plug for the house that we've got for sale. 11 White Road, Jensen.com is the address if you want to get to see the details. We are selling it ourselves. You save the agent fees and you can negotiate direct with us. Come and visit whenever you like. Just let us know. Give us a call. Um, and we're looking at offers above $595,000. Genuine offers, please. Um, there's the, uh, the house from the drone view. And there's the, uh, the parent retreat, master bedroom, pool's just there. And then there's the kids uh, area on this side of the house and the general living area on this side of the house and kitchen. Uh, that is the river, the Black River. And uh, there is water in it still and um, it's a magnificent sight during the wet season 
and a great uh, recreational place um, during the dry season. So drop in, uh, make an offer before it goes because I can guarantee it's going to go very quickly now that we've dropped the price. Thank you.